The Purdue Boilermakers, winners of their last six, have been firing on all cylinders. Last week against Wisconsin, quarterback Kyle Orton threw 55 passes to the Big Ten reception leaders John Stanford and Taylor Stubblefield. On the last drive, Orton drove the Boilermakers 82 yards for a game-winning field goal, which kept Purdue unbeaten in the Big Ten. The famed tunnel entrance at the big house in Ann Arbor, Michigan. We welcome you to the BCS Spotlight Game, presented by ADT. Doesn't get any bigger than this. Three wide receivers and three of the most dangerous in the business, Edwards, Avant, and Bruston. Perry breaks free. A 10-yard run for a first shot, and they bring Edwards back in motion. So on second and long, Navarro dropped the screen pass off to Perry, the running back, got an alley on the right side, and he's out to midfield and lands every year in the Big Ten. A lot of tough losses last year. Now on third down, Navarro stands middle, got him open. It's a bant. First down at the Purdue 31-yard line. Second down and long now. Navarre, pocket holds, and he's got Ivan again. So the basketball player from Carver High School in Chicago picks Second up it down. Navarre looks in zone. Got Edwards for the touchdown. Braylon Edwards, the junior from Detroit. And the Wolverines strike first. Joe Tiller said, tools in a big toolbox. Well, this is one of the biggest ones right here. John Navarre looks off left, holds the safety. And then puts six on the board for Michigan. Third down and 11. The blitz. Orton in a foot race gets away from Stevens. But he's smashed at the 31-yard line by linebacker Lawrence Reed, number 42. High snap. Orton's going to get hit from the ball. And Purdue pounces on it as Orton was crushed by Shazer. That's Slayton, number 46. Just did get it off. And again, it's the left side. And Preston crossing the field like he did last week. Looking for an alley. Still free at the 49-yard line. And the first thing I've done. 28 to go in the opening quarter. Perry again brought down at the 44-yard line. Second down and four. To the middle. And a first down for the Wolverines. Base 4 3 for Purdue. Navarre. Gonna go deep sideline. Avant's got a step. And the corner caught up with him. And there's a penalty flag as Rogers came up over on Avant. The penalty flag thrown by. The and it'll be first down for the Wolverines. In the round, it's Preston. Navarre's out to block. Here comes Preston, the speed burner. 10, 5, touchdown! You can't stop him. He's a cutback waiting to happen. Take a two-touchdown lead. Watch this. 100% of the time when Michigan goes in motion and back like that, they run the ball. Purdue had the key, just didn't have the athletes to catch this guy on a reverse. Swigert gets blocked with a touchdown. Dave Pierce at the center with an excellent blocking job. <laughs> Third down and nine. Here's Orton. Receivers are covered and he'll take off. No. Now in trouble. Deep uh, trouble. Uh, down at the 11-yard line. Reed there. Got to throw that one away, Gary. Sure does. Third down and long for Navarre. Hit fumble. Purdue's got it. Inside the 30-yard line, and the speed rusher shot. The running back is Boyd. Orton on the move right. Looks got a receiver open. Didn't see him. Now he takes off. Now fires intercepted in the end zone. 
So Kyle Orton makes the critical mistake, and Leon Hall, the freshman defensive bat, picks it off in the end zone. Orton lining up on the right side as a tight end. Second down and goal, and Orton's rolling in that direction. Pump fakes, he's covered, and Orton's down at the 11-yard line. Stevens makes the stop, and they were looking. For number four wide, they send the big fella, 6'9", down the bottom on the right-hand side. Looking for that fade, going jump ball. The stork knocked away, incomplete. The field judge said no interference, and Leon Hall goes jump. Kyle Smith is his holder. 27-yarder, Villarreal puts a snap on the money, and Purdue is on the scoreboard finally. But Are you starting to take notice yet? <laughs> yeah, the 72 Dolphins. <laughs> yep. You bet they are pulling hard for the Bills. And Avant, first down, spins away about a 14-yard gain on the play. And of course, the running back he's carried 16 times. And now it's 17 times. Burst of daylight, beautiful run out near midfield. A lot of talent that could get into Purdue academically. He likes going down there. And uh, Braylon Edwards, a very soft corner that time, and uh, not well played. And Edwards is inside the 30 yard line. Clark gets time, got one on one going end zone. Edwards in the air! Oh, what a catch by Braylon Edwards! His second touchdown in the game. He looked like a basketball player as he goes airborne over the corner. A junior, Jack told you that as of now, he plans to be back next year. Hmm, a few more catches like this, and the young man might reconsider, folks. This is pretty good. Time out. It's Michigan defense with the six defensive backs has ruled the day. And Orton is driven down at the five-yard line by Ernest Shazer. That's his second sack of the game. The two-minute drill when they go back on offense. Well, a stubble field pedaling away, getting ready. They're about to get it back here right after the um, Finley punt. Chambers, of course, bluffing fair catch, hoping it goes into the end zone. Michigan's down on it, and uh, a rule it is down at the one-yard line. Wolverines beating Purdue 21-3. Kyle Orton coming out now with first down. The ball! Touchdown, Michigan! Curry picks it up and goes in for the score. Watch Curry again on this play. Jones, the running back, trying to run behind the left side. And Curry. Beautiful swan dive. I'm out. I kept asking about Marlon Jackson. He kept saying, ask Lloyd. Ask Lloyd. <laughs> ask Lloyd. Orton's hit again. Backside blitz. Game free. Jeremy Lasseur coming in. And Gary uh, gave you his story. They're going to throw that quick flip to Avant. Let him go one on one. Breaks free. Comes down the sideline. The young man from Chicago with a burst inside the. 30-yard line. How about that, huh? Jason Avon and Steve Brustin. And, uh, man, are they dangerous. The bar wheeling it underneath now to Massapoy, his second catch of the game. And uh, he's it. Again, man, the long snapper. Gutierrez is the holder. This would be a 27-yarder. No frosting. And there it is, 31-3. They are just players on the Michigan team a little superior to the Purdue players. Yeah, that's a good point. Though. They certainly have looked at it. Orton is hit again. Diving interception at the 44-yard line. And Hall has done it again as his teammate, Lesur makes the hit. So now oh, there he is. Ready to go. As he'll get out to the middle of the field now with uh, Lloyd Carr. Going out to uh, shake hands with uh, Joe Tiller, and it was a uh, dominating performance by uh, by Michigan. That's the way it is, always one next week. 31-3, Carr and Michigan win it. A 